Hey, good morning everyone. It's Ryan and Paul. Hey guys. Resell CMI. We got our weekend eBay sales here. For those of you who don't know, we buy stuff, large collections, garage sale items, thrift stores, blah, 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 I blah. Everything. Yeah, we buy pretty much anything we can ship and a little more. We resell it online, try to make a profit primarily, almost exclusively on eBay. 44 items going out for $993.32. We got some viewer sales in there. We got some quantity orders. What's that? We just broke that 43 curse. That you said 44, and I remember we're saying oh, yeah. 43. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, the dollar figure is a little bit. Usually we're like 12 to 1500 on these good weekends, but I'll still take that. Um, we've been so busy. I think our only good real listing day last week was Monday. Thursday. One day we listed. Yeah, one day, yep. Um, so we'll get right to pulling these orders. If you didn't see before behind Paul here, I got a whole bunch of ornaments and some other uh, some bedding items there that I pre-pulled uh, just because they so similar and they come out of all these boxes we got stored. So you'll see me come back to those periodically. Uh, actually, I think we're starting over there. Let me grab my phone real quick. Yeah, yeah. Ornament just sold right before this video here. Uh, let's see. I notice on camera when I go to say things, I I incorporate like weird accents. I said like Vidya. Oh, Vidya. Yeah, I would never say that in my real life. I'd just fake for you guys. Uh, <laughs> the first one here is 1990. This is Village Noel Church. It's a Lennox ornament here. This sold for $12.50, free shipping. It's a little bit heavier than most of our free shipping items, but uh, we'll still make like six bucks or so on that. Get that top back on it. Next, we're going over to the turnstile. Right here. Perfect. This is a Matchbox Super Fast number nine Ford Escort RS2000 Phantom. It's a really clean for its uh, year in there. Uh, $15 free shipping on it's that. It's like a cool, you can definitely see like the age on that one. So, 15 free. Yep. And then another nice. ornament there. I got to figure out what ornament's what. <laughs> uh, oh, it's going to be this one. Right? Sun. Yeah. Hallmark ornament here. Sun. I think it's uh it's like 1980 uh nine dollars and 40 cents free shipping so again we're making like four bucks on that one uh next here we got two items from the same buyer here that's uh, one of them you want to cover that one yep this is a 1982 et school eraser and ruler pencil kit it's a pouch pretty cool 1050 plus shipping i think there was another one in there, there right one, yep 1050 plus shipping. And then the next one is right here in D33 for the same buyer. It's the last one of these to go out from the Baker buy. This is a Buck Rogers Space Communicator in its sealed blister pack, $17 free shipping. Nice, so that'll be easy to combine that one with this one with the free shipping. I'm not sure if, uh, if this is from a viewer. Um, Jessica, if you are a viewer, let us know in the comments or whatnot. Uh, thank you very much if you are. It's going to Bacon, New York. Uh, so not too far from us. I don't know where exactly where that is, but it is New York, so it can't Baker be too far. Beacon? It might be Beacon. <laughs> I think it, I've, I've I think Beacon, it, I think I've it is never been Beacon. Beacon. <laughs> <laughs> I'm hungry. What can I say? Uh, Jessica, thank you very much if you are a viewer. D6, that's what I'm saying. Oop. Okay, I think, I think we're pulling two different ones out of this eventually here. D6. 1992 Christmas bell. This is 1991. This is 1992. Ball. Is this a bell? No, it's not a ball. I said it wrong. It's ball. not a ball? Ball. Okay, I what's that, that one? Oh, wait, wait, put it. Okay, we got this uh, Yadro bell ornament, or a ball ornament there, 1992. Uh, sold for $7 plus shipping. Dan's E. E. Right there in front, looks like, yes, it is. One of these? It's that one. So there's two of them, right? I took pictures of the one without the top on it. Okay, so, so you want to send this first yeah. one out then? Yep. Okay, we got Pooh's Honey Tree. This is a Department 56. Um, these do pretty good, right? These snow yeah. babies. We've they, as long as they're uh, like Pooh or Disney Looney Tunes, thing, yeah, something. some Disney. Those other ones that are just snow babies that are the babies. Random, I, yeah, yeah, the ones that are there, a lot less money. Cheap, yeah. I know we've sold some that were up there too, yeah. surprisingly. This is 2004 Pooh's Honey Tree. This sold for $27 plus shipping. So, I mean, that to me, that's really good for something like that. 27 bucks. Let's see. This is going to uh, Pat. Yes. 
bought from us before. Yeah, he's been to our garage sales. He's bought multiple Star Wars things from us. Here he's picking up a 1978 Walrus Man loose figure. This came from Dan's. This yeah, was just a top. loose I one down in the tote. Yep. <laughs> right there, Walrus Man. Pat, thank you so much, man. Uh, we'll make sure to mention in our videos come springtime when we have another garage sale. Hopefully, you can make it back out. Thanks, man. I appreciate that. Right, D2. Yes, we do. This old one of them. How come we didn't do it a lot of two? We did before with the glove and the flat one. Oh, okay. You know what I mean? And then these were yeah, all the flat ones. These, that to me, like, you would want one for each side of the pan. So, like, a lot of two, quantity of three, instead of right. selling them individually. I think we lotted them up when I did it. And then these were, I did by themselves after we did the one was a glove and then the oven oh, man okay. lotted together. This is 1988 Green Giant Little Sprout Pot Holder, $10.79. Uh, free shipping on that one. Obviously, yeah, honestly, I don't know if people are going to use those as pot holders. They're just going to hang them up. Maybe well, I mean, clearly someone scary. bought one here, so. Yeah, and uh, we've sold them before. Turnstile yeah. again. Yeah, I think we were forced to sell them as one before, though. Oh, right here. Cosmic Blues. This is a Matchbox Super Fast again. Uh, Dodge Charger Cosmic Blues 1972. Eleven seventy five. It's gotta be shipping. super easy to see out that windshield. <laughs> Just hit the gas and print. <laughs> yeah. Hold it straight. <laughs> yeah, I'll separate the uh, cars so we don't screw them up. Next are the two beddings there together. Yep. Twenty five. Uh, I gotta make sure I refund the uh, combined shipping on this one. We got this Utica twin fitted sheet here, uh, two hundred count thread count. It's called Extravaganza. That one there sold for ten dollars plus shipping. And then we got this Martex. Uh, cotton flannel twin fitted sheet there um, that one right there sold for $15 plus shipping both going out to the same buyer um, they'll ship together I just got to refund the uh, combined shipping on that so they'll save I uh, sent a low offer out on this next one because I wanted to clear some shelf space where the heck is it yeah it's right behind all this stuff uh, what we're trying to pull out is that coffee maker right there Popcorn maker. popcorn maker oh, jesus man <laughs> i should run for president <laughs> you and biden sound the same right now holy freaking <laughs> crap not to get political or anything but i mean clearly you're lost clearly i'm you know uh head of state here there we go disney popcorn maker yeah this came from uh the jeff's this yes. is uh the lns old gas station uh just sent out <laughs> It's actually brand new in there. It's just the size of it um, hurt that with shipping prices and stuff. So I just sent out a, a really low offer of $10 to clear out that space. It's been listed for a while now. Got $10 plus shipping. I'm actually gonna move it over to my desk, Paul, just because we have so much more stuff to, uh, to pull there. Yeah, you can see it. And it's, like I said, it's like brand new in there. So someone's gonna have some fun with that. Uh, they must be pretty close. Only $18 to ship that. Next is T1. Gonna be behind this horn boat here. Uh, it's gonna be this real old willow, willow six and a quarter inch vase right there. Uh, if you watched any of our videos before, this real old willow stuff by Royal Dalton sells great. This one right here, nineteen dollars plus shipping on that one. Fourteen a. This was a surprise one too. You list this? Yeah. I don't. Even, was it a? Well, I don't even know what it is. A cocktail or something? Yeah, there, there's a cocktail spoon and a cork. Was in Super this. long, right? Yeah, it's Reed and Barton silver plated. Uh, it's a Christmas Santa Claus on each of them. Okay, so it's a holiday theme. Sam. Yeah. Silver plate. Obviously, and the other thing's just a up. cork in there with the same Santa on top. Like a wine cork or yep, something? Just a wine cork. Yeah, so that was together. cool. Sold for $27 plus shipping. Yeah, that's a good one. Reed and Barton's been selling good for us, even that was, silver plate we stuff. Have this drawer down here full of Reed and Barton stuff, too. Is really? I almost want to go through it. Yeah, you do that while I go I'm relax in the house. I'm getting the vine relaxed. All right, this has to be old. wiped out. It's down on the bottom there. It gets all the dog hair and the dust on it. This is a you can see it has the old Sibley's tag right in it, though. It's the uh, Great American Stoneware Factory. It's a nine-inch quiche plate. Is it only quiche? <laughs> it looked like That's a it. pie plate or something. 
Yeah, if you're down for quiche, you get this stoneware plate. Uh, this finally sold $16.19 plus shipping. Look at that. We're going to have to wipe that down really good. Uh, next is an ornament. Ornament. It's going to be this one right here. A little lighted ornament. Uh, Hallmark. Keeping cozy. Any of these lighted ones or the movement ones, we've had a few of them. Uh, that we had to refund just because they don't move. We're not going to sit there and test all these ornaments. Um, if they say they have a problem with this, we just almost refund almost automatically. This is going to be $10 free shipping on that one. That, is, uh, that doesn't mean buy a bunch of ornaments from us yeah, and then just us. try to get them for free and say that they're, <laughs> they're bad it's or anything. Again. Franklin Mint right here. Yeah, I think it's the last, last one. one. Yeah, Franklin Mint Antique Car Coin Collection. Um, what's it got? 25 different coins there. I think we had like three of these at some point. This is the last one. $12.59 free shipping on that. And next is another ornament, 1981. Yep, right here, Hallmark one. Uh, 1980, as you can see. $9.49 free shipping. And then another ornament. And then we got this Ouch. one here. Collage. Yep, Christmas uh, collage. Or as I would say, college. <laughs> uh, $10 free shipping. Are you going with the ornament still? Or? Nope. Okay, Pam. Pam this is another view. This is our viewer sale. Pam, she's one of our uh, best ones that comments all the time. She's bought things from us multiple times. She's going to get one of these. Probably want to take that the out. She actually wrote... Uh, Happy Veterans Day to two of my favorite veteran, veterans. Thank you for your service. Uh, I appreciate that. Yeah. Uh, this this past weekend was Veterans Weekend. And so thank Marine Corps you. birthday. What's that? And Marine Corps birthday was what, November Friday? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, the day before Veterans Day. So here's uh, Yoda in the chair for Pam. And then she ordered a vinyl also. Yep. So she picked that up, $9.49 free shipping. And then she picked up a cool vinyl, I thought. It's going to be EAS 81056. It is in the crate. Look at that. I can see the number. Oh, yeah. Usually I'm searching through this thing forever. Oh, this vinyl is pretty cool. Beatles Greatest right there. Um, it is open. Really good condition. Uh, $33 free shipping on that one. Uh, I'm not sure how exactly we'll ship these out. I'm gonna put that in a vinyl mailer. Put the well, the only thing box. is this this can go media mail and that can't. Oh, so yeah. we might have to figure something out there. But thank you so much. Um, you might get two packages there just because that might simplify it. Uh, plus we have the whatever's cheaper. Basically have stuff. I yeah. Might tape the two boxes together or might get two packages. Yeah. Whatever one's cheaper for us. Really. Thank you so much, Pam. Now we have five ornaments going out to the same buyer here. Five. Yep. Yep. Um, they kind of bought, they bought, so we got Christmas love right here and then we have this teacher one, right? Yep. Teacher. Yep. This teacher one. So you got these two right here were $19 and 49 cents combined. Then you got this mother one right here, acrylic one made by Hallmark, $10 free shipping on that one. So that's what 29 49 so far. Then we got this one, ten dollars free shipping here. It's the colors of Christmas. That's not the same order. Oh, it isn't. I skipped oh, over one. Yep, yep. Oh, it is a different. So we only got four yeah, that's for the I'm same. Talking. Okay. <clears throat> um, so that one's separate. Ten dollars by itself, free shipping. <laughs> yep, ten dollars free shipping. And then the last ornament here is this mother one, uh, nine dollars and forty nine cents free shipping again. So all these four get to go in the same box. Good catch with that, Paul. Um, I'll move this right over to the side. <clears throat> okay, yeah. So, uh, so what's that? Almost forty bucks for these ornaments. Yeah, so that's awesome. Too. Next, uh, D twenty-seven. I think this. D is D. Is oh, oh, yeah. Because I had to skip over yeah, one. D twenty-seven here. Last pair of these gloves, premium defense. Yes, this is the last pair. Yeah, these are heavy duty. Um, Thirteen fifty plus ship. Yep. Know. What do we have? Two or three pairs of these? Yep. From Dan's. Yep. Pretty cool. Always good when something like that goes up. Been listed a while. And then I was going for this over here on DD. It's gonna be this another Cinderella one. Hey, we can do it. It's 
It's got like a little needle mouse person, on there. This was listed at $71.99. And this person sent a message out I was out to dinner. Really? And they're like, will you take sixty five ninety nine? I'll immediately sure. reply yeah, with sixty five ninety nine. course. That's about where I'd send offers out on something like that anyway. But Those yeah, have done good for the Cinderella, Cinderella one's WDC 60 to 75 bucks all day. Uh, I'll set this way over this here. Bing Bear bought this next ET thing. And he's, both of them. Yeah, repeat buyer too. I can never remember everyone's name. Listen, so we have these listed for months and we sell both, both of them yeah. on the same day. Shane, if you're a, a viewer, let us know in the comments. I do remember the name and it does say repeat buyer. Uh, Shane, I, and I remember your last name too over in Washington there. Um, let us know. If not, thank you still. Um, E.T., you've seen this kit already once before. Uh, yep, right over there. Uh, so almost 12 bucks plus shipping on that one. We're back in D6 again for this next, this is crazy, both yep. Yadros. 1991. So this one's a bell ornament. This sold for ten dollars. Free, free shipping. I'm gonna put it away from the other Yadro. And then you got another ornament. Yep. Sold a few of those. Hallmark. This is Daffy Duck. I know we at least had a handful of these. Ten dollars and seventy-nine cents. Free shipping. Right next to it here, we got this. It's kind of cool. This is like aluminum. It's made to look like a tin toy kind of thing. 1980 Santa's flight ornament. This one sold for ten dollars and seventy nine cents, free shipping. Okay. This person actually sent us a message, wondering when we're going to ship this. Yep, today. yep. I responded today. Oh, yep. This is a Vera Bradley bag. It is brand new with tags. I want to say it has. What's that tag say? Seventy two bucks. Um, Seventy two dollars. Yep. Correct. Um, I bought like a handful of these bags at. Uh, I think at least three or four of them for five dollars a piece they were all brand new with tags they've been selling i think this is the last one actually to sell they've been selling uh like uh 25 to 40 dollars a piece this one out on offer 20 dollars plus shipping um yeah happy that one's going on i think it's one of the last ones uh paul said that there was a message about that already but there was also multiple messages leading up to that one this person has zero feedback. Um, they left a message, uh, or they wanted to know the bag height, or the bag um, <laughs> handle, what is it called? Strap, strap the bag strap length, and I gave them that. Then they asked if they there was we could do better than the offer that we already sent at $20, and honestly, I just ignored it, and then they ended up buying it, and then asking when we'd ship, and then the first thing this morning, because I had said we will ship uh, Monday, first thing this morning we got another message letting them, can we let them know when it's shipped? So either it's just, a, I hopefully it's just an eager person that wants it. Uh, typically I found out though, when you're dealing with somebody, not even with the low feedback, but just with the constant, like the, the question after question and really pushing for something, uh, they, I remember they asked for uh, if we have a return policy oh, too. Yeah. So obviously that's a big indicator too. Hopefully it all goes well. It is brand new with tags and I gave all hopefully, sorts of measurements. It's so it's an old lady and her first time ever using eBay and yep. she's just wondering. Yeah. She's going to be happy with her purchase. It's new with tags. On another note, guys, I got a little side thing here from doing this. I just did a scan this morning, a CT scan for my cancer. Obviously, if you guys have been following along, it's a little anxiety, but I'll find out. It should be in the next couple days. I'll, I will mean, i don't have a doctor's appointment until next Monday, but I'll be texting my doctor like crazy and well, wondering what the results are. Next Monday's are. chemo again, right? Yeah, and my So they're going to want to give you the results before they hit you with chemo. Well, they again, don't I'm want sure. to. What do you mean? They don't want to give me the results until I get there Monday. I'm going to have to call her to get the oh, results. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. They don't have any appointments before that. Oh, okay. I'm one that's just so persistent and my anxiety is so bad that if they know, I need to know even if it's bad before my appointment like i'm not going to sit here and wait a week and stress out for the results yeah. from this scan so in the next couple of days guys i should have results from the scan and i'll fill you guys in on our next video that we do yeah we'll make sure we let you know as soon as paul knows he's not shy about that oh uh, yeah this one's a little extra important too because after uh he gets the results from this scan he has that consult down in new york city uh the 30th 
Yeah. Yeah, so November 30th. And I actually read a lot more about that Dr. Solomon that's down there is doing this. Yeah. And uh, he's actually super aggressive. And even if he can't treat all of them, he still aims to try to do some because he's such a new procedure. Yeah. So that's really good news. Even if he can't get all of mine, he'll still treat what he can. He's been known to do that. Yeah, that'd be pretty, that'd be awesome, obviously. And then obviously with the scan, you're just hoping for no, no growing. No growing, no and new. at the very least, no growing. Hopefully, yeah. shrinking. Yeah, shrinking in the opposite direction. And nothing so. new anywhere. Yeah. That would be horrible. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Yeah, so wish Paul locked down in the comments and stuff like that. And then uh, hopefully within the next few days, we can let you know. At the very least, it'll be early next week, we can let you know. So, All right, next, uh, we'll go back to Poland here. D26. Yeah, we sold a few of these. Yeah, all recently, too. There it yep, is. These little PVC figures. There's six different Baby Yodas. You can see we have three left. Um, I want to say we started out with like nine different... Uh, little lots like this just six different PVC figures. They were brand new in all their individual boxes But the boxes were so dented. I just took them all out and made these little lots uh, $13.49 they're pretty light and stuff. So we make like six bucks or so maybe seven bucks off each one Happy happy this is going out too, man You see how many we have some of them got some crap packaging. Well, that huh? one's the realister. Oh, okay yeah, so right here, uh, we've got this Royal Limited Keepsake Frog. It's like a little trinket dish. The whole top half of it comes off. We sold like three of these or so. Yeah, five uh, left. <laughs> yeah, $13.49 plus shipping on that one. Stay in here. In the picture, you're only going to see three of these, but it does say four in the title, so I don't know what the deal is with that. Um, maybe maybe uh, Paul's daughter found one after and just added it to the title instead of redoing all the pictures. Yeah, I think so. But uh, we're going to include all four. I already checked the active listings to make sure one of these ones are being sold loose to. It's Santa's. Uh, there's these like different little uh, uh, just decorations that they, they open up and you can set them up on the table. There's Santa's Sweet Shop and some Snowman ones. Uh, this lot of four, nine dollars twenty-five cents, free shipping. Super they are super lights. We'll only make like three, four bucks off those. Uh, happy they're going out though. This is a D twenty-four. So yeah, it's Baker, but yeah, it's not this. for Baker. It's from a garage sale. I, I've put it in the book the right way. Uh, dry snorkel here, made by Ocean Master. It's a vintage one. Uh, this stuff doesn't have tons of value. I've actually, I had the mask and the fins too. I just added them into our garage sale tote. So, so uh, they'll be in our garage sale in the spring. Uh, the snorkel though sold $15 plus shipping. I paid five bucks, I think, for all the, the gear. Right. And I listed like two or three things. The rest is going in a garage sale. I wouldn't buy it all again, but I'm happy that sold. Next one's pretty cool. I did not think this list was going to go out. This, I thought we sold all the things. I was hoping it was that things. tractor because yeah. that's like 50 bucks. <laughs> I, I, I thought we sold all the things from a slots buy and we didn't. We still have these signs that are left and they've been bouncing around, but here it is. The shell one. The shell one. Yeah, these are pretty delicate. Uh, they have little people and little st like uh, ladders and stuff that can move around. But it's basically billboards that you can put around your slot car sets. Um, let me move this out of the way before I scratch or something stupid. There we go. Kabas hair everywhere. All right. Uh, yeah, this billboard though sold good. Twenty six dollars plus shipping. Mm -hmm. uh, they do plug in and light up and all that stuff. Uh, we got two more. It looks like over there, different ones. This is right here. Okay, this is from the Wizard of Oz, nineteen seventy four. Second one of these we've sold. Yeah. Yeah, a couple different figures from there. It has the tags on the bottom, has the tags hanging uh, hanging off. It's the Cowardly Lion there. $22.50 free shipping on that one. I did free shipping on those. In Hopefully case they wanted to buy the whole set. set but yeah, that's no what I'm figuring. Yet. Okay, this is the third one of these Money to go the out, bank. too. Said that last week. Look at that. Boom. There's uh, three more after this. These are brand new sealed. Um, took a while. Uh, I think I had them listed for 75 bucks. They're on sale and they've been selling right here. $67.50, 25th anniversary limited edition, eight record set for Elvis Presley. Um, yeah, brand new sealed. Just an awesome one. Uh, Put around the other vinyl. There, careful with that. 
Yeah, seventy or sixty-seven bucks. And that's just some real old willows again. Yeah, and uh, a repeat buyer. Repeat buyer, yep. First one right and there. First one's right here. This is the majestic uh, two and a half inch saucer and uh, what do you call that? Tea. I six off that. six inch saucer, two Sorry. and a half inch tall teacup or whatever. <sighs> I'm gonna have to dust these off too. This right here though, so for thirteen dollars forty nine cents plus shipping, and then that plate yep. sold right there. Yep. Last one of these. What did I do? Okay. This is a Royal, a Royal Dalton Boost Real Old Willow, the Majestic Collection, and this is a uh, eight inch serving plate. So a small serving plate, fifteen dollars plus shipping. Yeah, so it'll be uh, twenty eight dollars and fifty cents combined shipping. I'll have to package this one up good. Make sure it's not clinking around or anything. Again, Real Old Willow. You know, we got almost thirty bucks there, and I think another eighteen or nineteen there. Awesome. And then we got a loose ornament here. You saw this one. Oh, well, we have the same thing here, loose. $9.49 free shipping. And then we have one more ornament. I don't know what one it is. The Wonders of Nature. Oh, it's right here. This one that's bagged up right here. It has, uh, looks like a quail on the side of it. Bob White quail. $10 free shipping on that. Yeah, so uh, great sales. Just shy of a thousand bucks. A lot of small stuff. Get your ornaments up. They're selling freaking like crazy right now. Um, you know, we had some nice sales of like 60, 70 bucks in there. Thank you guys for the viewer sales too. Really help round out the weekend. We, you know, none of you have to do that, but if you do do it, please let us know in the comments or uh, leave us a little note or a message or something yeah, like that so know. we know that it is a viewer sale. Because there's, it's weird too, because sometimes. I see different names than uh, what it shows on eBay, like compared to YouTube and stuff. So it's hard to balance out everything and and know who the re or, or who the viewer sales are. So thank you very much for that. Yeah. We're gonna get all this stuff shipped. What do you got? A parent teacher conference? To go to? Yeah, my daughter, my youngest, has a parent teacher conference at one o'clock. I gotta head to. But this week, a uh, little note: we do plan on uh, at least I. I don't know if Ryan didn't tell you this, but uh, Ryan and I went hunting Saturday morning up to my uncle's and Ryan plugged a nice eight pointer and yeah. uh, he'll insert the screenshot right here. Doosh. Congratulations to him. Him and I had a good epic time together in the woods and that, that, yeah, was, that fun. was fun. But that means this week we should be able to work a lot more. Yeah. We got, uh, we bought some vinyl, some rap vinyl actually that you guys haven't seen yet. I'm going to try to hop on that this week so I can get lots of listings up because I'm a machine when it comes to the same thing over and over. And, I don't know what Ryan plans on working, but we're definitely going to be working. I'm not going to work. Yeah, he's just going to do Ryan. I'm going to go right back out hunting. No, <laughs> <laughs> no but uh, he's leaving today. But after today, we should be good to go to uh, do a bunch of listings. So thank you all very much, Paul. Yeah, see you guys in the next one. Take care, everyone. Say Resell CNY. Resell CNY. Said, please like and subscribe. Please like and subscribe. <laughs> Say thank you. Thank you. And bye. Bye. Bye, guys. Right. Thank you. Bye.